how is everyone doing i hope everyone is having a lovely lovely day you've had a fantastic week i hope yeah now okay so today's topic is a bit like self-explanatory although we find it's hard for us to say no sometimes whether we're being asked to pick up more responsibility without extra pay or even someone asking for your advice you know it can be challenging to to say no speaking up for yourself can be quite a challenge for um, recovering people pleasers or very active people you know it can be very hard for them to say no so the reasons of even it becomes even hard to say no is maybe when you're thinking oh man what kind of person will I be if I refuse to help people and maybe you're also thinking people will dislike me for not you know helping out these are the kind of things that these are the kind of fears that are uh, that come with someone being unable to say no and which are quite valid you know quite valid and uh, it's also true to say that saying no is a skill that needs to be learned not most of us know how to say no so today I've come with some tips on how to say no gracefully and still you know have strong boundaries and without alienating other people here are some of them okay so I'm gonna make this I'm gonna break them down to three main things that you can do first you can apologize apologize and tell the truth apologizing can go a long way and telling the truth also so it can don't 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 be the person who waits the last minute to wiggle out of a plan so you guys had plans to meet up maybe do something together but then all of a sudden your plans changed or you know you had a change of heart you don't wait till the last minute to be like hey i don't think i'll be coming today when someone maybe is already at the location they're texting you like yo where are you and then you're like oh i'm sorry he don't think he can make it no don't be that person just apologize in advance before even that day you cannot it can be it can be good to even apologize immediately when you realize that you're not going to go ahead with these plans you know don't wait don't wait till the last minute someone maybe is expecting you you know apologize and tell the truth that is tip number one tip number two explain what you can do now I'll give an example of uh, maybe you have a job at a, at a certain firm right and then a friend of yours applies for the job at your firm but there's a vacancy or whatever then they apply now your friend comes to you and says hey I applied at your job it would be nice of you if you top me up to the HR and maybe you're not comfortable with doing this because I mean you can't you, maybe maybe you can't even um, uh, you, you can't account for their behavior so you don't know the kind of person you'll be recommending and if they could jeopardize your reputation at work or even where you are at work or even for other reasons completely right but now you don't know how to tell your friend this you don't know how to tell your friend no <laughs> um i wouldn't do that <laughs> you know so you can easily oh, not easily you can just tell them that hey i don't think i can do that but this is what i can do maybe i can recommend you to the person previously in that position i can give you their contact and maybe they can help you uh, know what to prepare for for an interview and maybe guide you on whatever the the people are looking for you know tell them what you can do instead be like yeah no i don't think i can do that but this is what i can do um i'm not sure i can give you 10 million but how about maybe three you know like you can always tell them what to do and number three you can redirect them to other sources now for instance for someone like me who does videos when someone wants to know about contraceptives and everything i'll be like ah you can you know what instead of us meeting up to talk about this how about you go watch a certain video that i've done about it you know you can easily redirect someone to other resources or if you're not an expert at it the things that you don't even know yourself tell them yeah i know an investor are investing whatever what are they called investing officers or yeah <laughs> people who tell you about investments and everything i know someone who can help you with it how about you talk to them yeah you can easily redirect you don't have to 
do everything or be a master of all or there are other things that you've already done you can redirect your blog post blog post whatever it is now these are the three main ways that i think that you can say no gracefully and without feeling guilty if you like what you hear please apply and you know when you know better you do better guys now thank you so much for being with me until the end of this video please leave a comment like and subscribe i know people don't like being told that but hey yeah i have to tell you you've been here for all this while watching my videos and not subscribing hey you must like me but you don't want to show me eh? <laughs> have a good one coco clan see you next week bye